I'm back to do another show and tell on this hair that I picked up from Amazon. The company is called One More, One More Hair, <laughs> not two more, one more. And I have their 26 inch silky long straight black synthetic hair. It's um, with a natural bang. It says the color is 1B, the texture is synthetic fibers. You can actually heat this up from 150 Celsius to 320 degrees Fahrenheit. I don't know about Celsius. I could do the Fahrenheit though. Um, the length is 26 inch and it says that the cap size can adjust to fit any size um, head or different sizes um, head. So this is the actual box that it came in. And they also sell human hair wigs. Ladies, please feel free to check them out. I will leave the direct page down below for you with all the information um, as far as this product and other products. And on the back of your box, it gives you some instructions, what to do, what not to do, as well as um, other products that they do offer. So let me go ahead and remove this from the box. All right, so upon opening your box, you will receive their pamphlet with some in information inside as well as on the back it gives you some social media um, sites where you can also find them they send you a cute little hair tie reminds me of a bunny and they send you a free stocking cap and this is the actual hair so it says 26 inch on there and let me go ahead and remove her all right my queen so this is the hair and she is long my queens this is the actual front of the wig with the bang this is the actual top of the wig and let me flip her inside out so you don't get a comb in the back but you do get your adjustable straps you have ear tabs in the front of the unit and then you get one comb directly in the front of this wig so if you want to, you can always stop in your local beauty supply store. And I know I love security in my wig, so just get you some combs and you can always sew one in the back of the wig if you want to. The texture on this hair, it's not shiny. It's more on the um, slight yakky um, side, but soft at the same time. You're definitely probably gonna receive some tangling because the unit is 26 inches long. And um, as far as shedding, I'm getting a few strands. I'm gonna show you actually how much I actually pulled out just by pulling on the hair. So this is what I've actually removed so far. And it could just be because the unit's brand new. So what I'm gonna do now is remove the little tag that's on here and I'm gonna try her on. If I left anything out, leave me a comment or you can always email me. My email address will be in the description box. So let me go ahead and try her on. I'm so happy that there's no lace for me to remove on the wig because I really hate doing that. All right, my ladies. So this is where I've adjusted the actual strap. So let me go ahead and put her on. All right, ladies, so there's a lot of room underneath this wig. The bangs are extremely long. I'm gonna go ahead and cut those. But this is the um, kind of hair that is so inexpensive. Like if you wanna pull off that um, cute, you know, look and not spend a lot of money, it's not shiny, like I said. So if you think that it is, you can always get um, dry shampoo to tone the um, shine down. Um, or baby powder not sure if there's any other products out there but so far those two are the only two that I'm aware of so I'm gonna back up so you can see how long this hair is and I am 5'11 my queens and I have a long neck so this is where the hair hits me and if you are shorter with a shorter neck then it's gonna be even a little bit longer on you but this is all the hair to the front and this is all the hair to the back. The hair is absolutely gorgeous. I love the 1B color that it's giving me right now. This is the actual side of the wig. So the air tabs line up 
just in place and this is the other side so she does fit ear to ear um the cap is very very comfy by the way and i'm going to lift this up so you'll see underneath i have a big forehead too oh god all right so yeah and then let me lift the wig in the back so you could see that and that's the back so let me go ahead i can't even see right now <laughs> Some people like to pull their wigs back like this. But then it feels funny to me. It feels like it's going to fall right off. <laughs> so I'm going to pull it back down, but I'm going to actually cut these bangs because that's where they are. And I cannot see right now, like blind. I'm like blind, completely blind. So yeah, I'm going to trim these on camera because someone um, said to me before, when I was trying to demonstrate how to cut your bangs and have them fall in the same uniform shape as they were before, um, they didn't get it. So I'm gonna do it now so you can see. So I'm gonna put this hair up. So it's all this, the longer strands are out of my way. And then I'm gonna actually show you how the stylist actually cut bangs to get them in the right format. So let me get my scissor. All right, so let me just brush this down. So now I'm gonna figure out where I wanna trim my bang. So if I'm not looking at you, I'm looking at my mirror because I'm trying to see what I'm doing at the same time. So. I'm thinking I want to cut that much off on the bottom. So you hold it like that. Then you twist it. And hold it again. So now I have it twisted and I know exactly where I want to trim. So I'm holding it with the twist in place and I'm just going to cut. Let's throw this hair away. Right, now let's see if it turned out the way I want it. Not bad. All right, so I gotta touch up some loose ends on this. I almost poked my eyes out. <laughs> so I'm just trimming the excess hair. But do you see how everything just falls? Into place. Actually covered in hair right now. All right, so let's bring all the hair back. All right, my queen, so what do you think about this hair? This hair is gorgeous. She's gorgeous. It reminds me of Angelina Jolie in the movie Salt. If you guys haven't seen that, it's a very good movie. But yeah, so this is it. I'm going to add a little bit of powder on the top to make it look like my scalp is showing up there. So I'm just going to use some of my um, L'Oreal True Match N7. And I'm just going to add just a little bit right on the top of this wig. See if it gives it just a different look. You know what I mean? See that? All right, my queen. So let me know what you think about this hair. Um, this hair can be put in a ponytail as well. It's good for if you're running to the gym. You could just throw this wig on and put a hair tie in the back. Let me do that now. So yeah, put it in a um, little tie like that. You're off to the gym or the store, or you can always bring the hair to the side. You 
and put a braid in it. Yeah, <laughs> or you can always put a braid in the hair. <laughs> so yeah, overall, this hair is going to tangle. Uh, I have one of these um, brushes that I use, but it's one that folds. It's like a little compact brush, and you can get that in Walmart uh, in this section where they have like these little 99 cent um, shampoos and um, toothpaste holders, cases, and stuff like that. So yeah, you can put a braid in the hair. This is how I always wear my hair. Sometimes when I'm at work and I wear like a long wig, I'll put it to the side like that. I think it's really cute. But yeah, let me know what you think about this hair overall. This is beautiful. It's one of those hairs that you wanna keep in your collection. You can always bump the ends on the actual um, bang, which I'm gonna do because I know someone's gonna say I should have done that. So let me go ahead and get my iron ready. <laughs> all right, all right, so I think this is ready. So I'm just gonna bump this just a bit. All right, my queen, so not the best job in the world, but at least it's not straight across. So yeah, this is what I came up with. So I'm definitely gonna leave this actual unit down below so you can actually find her if you are looking for that beautiful straight black hair with bangs. This is the one, my queens. But keep in mind that she is going to tangle because, again, she is actually 26 inches long. Okay, and this is her all the hair to the front. So, yes, if I left anything out, just leave me a comment down below or shoot me an email. But this is really cute. So, yes, I will definitely leave the link for one more hair on Amazon and you can definitely check them out. So if you have not already subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Do not hesitate. And to all my subscribers, you ladies know I love you. All right. Um, like and share this video. Give me a thumbs up for this video and don't forget to turn on your notification so you will not miss out on any of my future uploads. All right, my queen. So until my next hair show and tell, Please take care of yourself, stay fabulous, be blessed, keep a clean heart, and I love you. One love. Mwah. <laughs>